Why? I say it quietly. Because I am coming to you today with the grass on my head. The grass is what makes a difference. This grass was grown with all that stuff sprayed on it, the aluminum. So when they harvest it, it's already like an antenna. Could you imagine that with your mosquitoes and your Zeta virus and all that stuff? Anyway, that's not what we're here to talk about. What we're here to talk about is I'm keeping my brain protected with my grass. Hat. The one on my head. I ain't showing you what's under there because it would scare you wildly. Anyway, what we got is a fallacy. A true fallacy. And I ain't talking about the ivory tower fallacy because that's a fallacy. Just like over there in that place, in the boot, where the volcanoes survive. What we got is the fallacy. That we can go back and get to what we used to be. That somehow, after this and that and the other, that we can be what we used to be. And of course, catfish, because of my knowledge, I take and look at it like the energy, the energy of flow. And I see the stop and go. And I see the equations that have these breaks and these points, and they drop out, and you can't come back and reset it. I keep telling you, it is not one of them games. It's not Atari. It's not one of them things I had. Them, I don't even know what it was, but it was, it was, it, it, it took my time. So I took it out and smashed it like the CRT, which is why. Ain't gonna get me. So, what we got is everybody thinks somehow that after a certain time, you can get somebody in, talk for you, blah, 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 blah. they talk for you. They be who you can't be. They talk to the people you can't look in the eye. But I'm trying. So, give me an A for that. I'm trying. What was they trying to do? Oh, they look in the eye and they're telling you. We're going to do this, we're going to do that, we're going to do the other. And yet, they be lying to you. Lying to you. This ain't no video game. Well, is it you do not understand that this is not a video game? Do you live in an apartment somewhere? And when the food supply chain break down, you're going to eat your neighbor. People been telling you, watch the sun. Get the hell out of the city. What's wrong with you? It is a nitty gritty. Ain't you heard all them e dancing songs and stuff from back in the 70s and 60s? And the, yeah, built that city. Yeah, you built that mother. And guess what? Babylon is a Babylon. And that's what's very interesting about the whole thing. Coach Catfish been seeing this, watching it, and absorbing it. And it's like a diaper that absorbs all the shit and the piss that comes out of that baby that wants to be born. I think it's the grass on the head that's making me understand this quantum archetyping model of reality. I've been trying to say for years. I've been trying to explain this stuff to you people for years. But nobody listens. Nobody listens. In mathematics, in the formula, in the wave functions, in the two-dimensional XY plane. See, you can model stuff, and it will do this, and it will do that. And what they have done is they have done the calculation of your nation. And they fit your ass to it, which is not organic. Don't you understand? When he lives on the earth, you've got. To be involved in the earth. You gotta touch it. You gotta scratch it. You gotta go out and do some gigging. Run them trying. Do them yo-yos. 
Go to them snake. Get them gator. Scratch up the ground. Get you some dynamites to clean out your pooping, pooping path. Because that's what you're missing. You got to get out. Because this shit ain't working. Can't you see what's happening? Oh, Coach Catfish is okay. My answer hasn't been by you. You never see me. I crawl enough into a tree. You will never see my ass. Because I was a coon ass. And I'm proud of it. That's where my family come from. Anyway, if you want to play that game, you can wait for that reset and see if your ass is on the other side. What can I say? I'm just reading a script. A nondescript script. It's just all in my head. Create your own realities. Looking in the mirror. And if you live your life that way, the truth will be much clearer. Create your own realities. Looking in the Torah. If you live your life that way, the truth will be so much more. Hallelujah. I know this stuff is silly, but you know what? We got to laugh a little bit. I think Yahweh laughed a little bit. I think he laughed at his ass. Oh, he popping up. He don't do that. Because Catfish just an idiot. But I do the best I can. I try to be on the right. Hallelujah. Praise. Thank you, my Messiah.